Hey everybody, it's Kat, aka Dirty Princess, um, here at my truck again, waiting to start work. So, um, wanted to go ahead and do some makeup tutorial for you guys again. So, and by the way, so, um, I've had a few questions asked, um, why I always say aka Dirty Princess. So, my truck is actually named Dirty Princess. It's her name, not my name. Um, she's my girl. She's my boo. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much where the name came from. So if you're ever curious, Dirty Princess is technically, uh, my truck, but she's my girl. So today, um, I am going to, again, I'm going to use the Care Bear, um, palette. I did use it, um, about a week ago or no, it hasn't even been a week yet. Um, about a week ago I'll link the video at the end of this video of uh, me doing this palette once before um, the colors are actually well in here they're um, quite ooh, if I don't drop everything they're quite bright um, but they don't come out that bright so yeah so yeah uh, but I had a good friend of mine uh, tell me how I can potentially make them bright. So I'm going to try it today and see where we get. But even if they don't come out bright, that's okay. Um, just because I am going to be going to work again. Um, so, and normally I'm in a scrub top. So I kind of prefer if it's not really bright anyways, but, uh, I will be pausing the video throughout just to, I'm going to do one eye, do the other eye, that type of thing. We all know I suck at doing this eye. Um, <laughs> but so y'all don't have to watch me make all funny faces and try to do it. So, um, and I'm trying to be good. So sorry, that was a tease. Um, I am actually doing my lashes at the end now. So, um, but I still eyeliner that that's going to go on first. Uh, that's just my preference. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick and I will be right back. Okay, uh, so I have done my upper lid. I kind of forgot to say um, the eyeliner pencil I use is the um, NYX Cosmetic uh, brand one. It's just the black. Um, it's eyeliner, um, eyeliner and um, eyebrow. There we go. So um, sorry I forgot to mention that, but figured I would bring you guys back. Um, and let you know what it is. Again, I apologize if I'm blocking the camera. Again, this is my go-to um, bag I have had for years. If you have not watched my um, other video of me doing my makeup in my truck before, um, I do have a playlist with these videos that will be done in my truck. Um, so feel free, you can check it out. For some reason, my nose ring, I swear there's a hair stuck to it or something. Because it is going to drive me batty. Okay. Besides that point, I'm going to go ahead and go with my trusty Urban Decay uh, Eye Primer. Um, it's kind of my go-to. Again, if you haven't seen any of my videos, this is one I use all the time. Um, it's the only one I've actually had like really good results with. Um, I've used others in halfway through the day, I have a crease going. This one, I have never had that issue. Um, so it's my go-to one. So, um, if there's one you like, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Um, or maybe a palette you would like me to try out. Any of that, feel free, leave a comment below with the info. Um, I would love to start, um, experimenting. With different palettes so again I like to um, use my finger as the um, applier for this um, I don't like to use my makeup brush um, just due to and <laughs> the fact that I only carry one brush on me especially when I'm out I've been pretty bad about other videos at my house and stuff only using one um, I will get in the habit of actually using more, um, but currently I just use the one and I forgot to grab out uh, something to wipe off my finger. So I will do that in a second, but, um, 
yeah, just let me know if there's anything you guys would like me to try out. I would love to try uh, new palettes, um, mascara, liner, um, eye primer. <laughs> oh, it's not even, well, it's still morning, but it's not morning for me anymore. Um, I've already gotten off one of my jobs. Um, and I still can't talk if my life depended on it. So um, I have my go-to makeup remover. Um, if I can open this thing. Uh, I want to call them tissues because they look like tissues. Um, I got them actually the other day. They're um, a little on the strong side, actually. Uh, not a bad thing, though. Um, it, it's strong because it has roses in it. Or rose, rose stems? with rose stem cells smoothing. Yeah, it's that. Um, it, it's been pretty good. I don't actually mind it. It's, when you're not expecting it for the first time you use it, wow, that's rosy. But it, it's nice. It's smooth. Um, I didn't have an issue with my skin reacting to it. So I like these. Um, this is a different brand I haven't ever actually used before. Shift knob comes in handy. So FYI, I do drive a stick. So that's there. It's a good ha uh, handy tool there. Um, but yeah, normally I use, um, forget the brand now. I think it's maybe, no. I forget the brand now. But it it's kind of comes in like a purplish packet. Um, that's normally my go-to. But I want to try something different. And I've seen these and they're actually not that bad. They're just not expecting it at the start. So have the eye primer on. Um, looks pretty good. Oh, my poor, uh, if all you could, if you guys could see my poor mirror, it's, so I've had this thing since like high school, maybe even middle school. And it's so warped on th this side of the mirror that it's all like weird projecting. But yeah, besides that point. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and grab my eye palette. Um, the, it's the Care Bears, uh, Unlock the Magic. Now I'm not a hundred percent sure, um, which eyeshadows I'm going to do today. Um, I was kind of thinking of doing the, uh, orangey brown tones. Uh, so Tender Heart Bear, Love a Lot Bear, and Fun Shine Bear. So it is those three going that direction. Um. I'm gonna give those a shot. Though I will say Love a Lot Bear and Fun Shine Bear look exactly the same. Maybe like very, very, very slight difference, but they look exactly the same. So again, this is my trusty go-to. Wait, it's okay. So <laughs> my trusty go-to um brush applicator, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to attempt to actually use the mirror in this. Uh, last time I didn't want to because it was harder to use. Uh, I will say it's still going to be interesting to use it, but I'm going to give it a shot. So I'm going to go in with the fun shine, which was the one in the dead middle of the palette. It's kind of the um, um, softer, lighter tone. And I'm just going to start in the um, inner side of the eye. So if you did not watch my other video, my main problem with this palette is it looks really bright. It looks really cool. You get it on and there's like, you can't even see it. So I'm going to try with what one of my girlfriends, a really good girlfriend of mine said, which is get it on there, get your, um, eyeshadow. I was going to say your primer. <laughs> Get your eyeshadow on there. Take your setting spray and spray it. Now, I don't know how well this works, but I'm going to give it a shot. So there we go. And by the way, that's Urban Decay uh, setting spray. Um, it's kind of one that actually goes with my skin. My skin tends to be oily, but um, I do not do full face unless I have breakouts. Then that's a totally different story. But even that, I, I hate doing full face. I've never been a person that does full face. I am more just eyeshadow 
and be um, as real as possible, I guess you could say. So, um, this isn't bad, actually. It's, it's kind of a, kind of an orangey look. It's cute. So, I'm going to go ahead and pause for a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and do that. I uh, get them matching up here, and I will be back in a little bit. Thank you. Okay, so I got the um, Fun Shine <laughs> Bare Eyeshadow on. Um, it kind of um, kind of has an orangey tone, but it's actually not that bad. And I will say, and thank you so much. So my girlfriend, Amber, is um, the one that suggested it with the setting spray. Um, it did do a difference. It actually looks better than it was. Um, it's still light. But a lot better. Um, so now I'm gonna go in with. Um, I think. Mm. <laughs> like I said, I should have figured this all out before actually making the video. So um, yeah, that's how my day is going. So I'm gonna go in with. Uh, let's do love a lot bear. Um, or. Mm trying to decide between the love a lot bearer or tender heart um because I do want to do an under um and I was thinking the kind of darker would look kind of cool there um so I think I'm going to do the love a lot bear which was the middle um middle orangey tone so it was this one right there um I'll go ahead I'm going to go ahead and do that one um, as kind of the outer, um, outer of the eye. Wow. That's, that's orange. That is like really orange. Okay. But it's okay. It's okay. It's kind of blended down, but it's okay. We got this. I'm trying to be a little bit more like open to colors, not so dark. Um, Yeah, it literally looks exactly like the other one I just put on. So, I'm going to do the setting spray. And actually, I do have to say it does it does work. So, I have a quite a bit on there, as you could see. Um, grab my setting spray. One little spurt. Let's see if I don't get the mirror this time. Man, there is just a lot of fallout with this makeup. But that is okay. We got this. Yep, still looks orangey. Um, it's a little bit brighter. God, my poor lashes are just like covered in this. This one is like this specific one, uh, the Love A Lot Bear one. That is actually like really like powdery. Like, it is, like, falling everywhere on me. Okay. Um, that's... Uh, the other one... Yes, I will admit the other video I did, uh, there was fallout, but not like this. Like, this is a lot of fallout. Like, I don't know if I'm so hot about that. Um, but, yeah. Yeah, th this color, there's like no tone change. So yeah, okay. I'm pretty sure you can't see a difference, but I am going to go ahead and pause. I'm going to go ahead and do my other eye. I'm going to use my makeup remover um, napkin, tissue, whatever you want to call it, to go ahead, because I know once I do this eye, there's going to be fallout too. So I'm going to go ahead and I'll use that uh, on both of them just to kind of clean it up. So give me a little bit. I will be back. Okay, so before I actually go to the other eye, um, I'm going to go ahead and come in here just because the sun is in the right area. Close my eyes. You can see it on my lashes. <laughs> there's a lot of fallout. Um, so yeah, um, my poor lashes. <laughs> So, just wanted to show you that, but I'm going to go ahead and do the other eye real quick, and then I will uh, continue this. <laughs> okay, so I've done both sides. Really quick. Uh, bleh, very, <laughs> really quick, I'm going to go ahead and close that. Um, 
clean up my brush a little bit here. Um, so it looks skin tone more than anything. Um, woo, sorry, sun is like really bright there. But um, there is just so much fallout, like with that one color. Like you could see where I'm wiping it off. So um, I'm gonna kinda go where it's clean. <laughs> ah, let's stab myself in the eye, it's okay. <laughs> okay, that part, it was a pretty, ah, pretty good uh, clean wipe. My poor, um, eyelashes. I couldn't think what they were called. Those things that are attached to your eyelids. <laughs> um, they're, they're like fully covered. I don't know how well you'll see it, but like it, it these poor things. So, um, I'm just going to kind of use this. There we go. Okay. Hold on. But yeah, I mean, just that little bit. Thoro, Thoro. <laughs> so just that little bit. There's actually quite a bit on there. But besides that point, um, I'm having way too much fun. I have been up since like, what, like 2.40, I think it was when I got up in the morning, a.m. So, because I work 4 a.m. in the morning. And then I work another job at 10 a.m. in the morning. So now I'm going to go in with a tender Tender heart bear. I was going to say tender bear heart. Oh, lordies. Like I said, long day. I don't know about this. I really don't, peeps. Um, I want to kind of go in the crease some. <laughs> okay, y'all, this is funny. <laughs> this old man is like kind of jogging. I don't know if you're going to be able to see him in the side of my camera over there oh he moved the other way <laughs> he's like kind of jogging not really um I, I hate to laugh but <laughs> it was really funny he's he's more the he's more like walking um but yeah it, it was yeah that was great sorry <laughs> one of the again it's one of those ooh shiny moments um So, yeah, I'm, that was a noisy truck. Um, just kind of going in the uh, crease, making the crease darker, um, which it actually doesn't look that bad. So I'm trying to do um, work appropriate makeup, I guess you could say. Um, just because the field that I am in, I don't know how they would feel with, y'all should really get that checked. Um, sorry. <laughs> I don't know how they would actually feel if I had like, wow, makeup on, but at the same time, um, they don't care if we have tattoos that show, um, or piercings or anything like that either. Um, I work with one very amazing person that, um, she has a lot of tattoos, piercings. I look up to her like full on. I truly actually look up to her. Um, it's where I would love to be one day. Um, if you've seen some of my videos, especially my Jeffree Star, the reveal, the box that I got, uh, seeing how bad it was damaged from the post office. If you actually go and watch that video, you could see pretty much my chest is covered. Um, not most of my arms, but, um, a lot of my arms, uh, are covered the way I'm going. I wouldn't be surprised. Give it a few years and I am fully covered, not fully covered, but where I want to be coverage. Um, I'm addicted to tattoos. I will be fully honest. Uh, I wanted to be a tattoo artist, but I could never tattoo dumb stuff on stupid people. 
So y'all that have bad tattoos, yeah, you're, you guys are the reason that I won't be a tattoo artist. Now, my personal business that I run on the side is a, I do custom embroidery work. That I love doing because I actually get to make dumb stuff, stupid things, because it's not permanent. Yes, it is, but it's not. Um, it, it's one of those... The clothing can be thrown away, or the if it's made into a patch, the patch can be ripped off, that type of thing. I have a, there, glitter. Um, something like that. So I, I don't mind it. I, I can do that. So I get to actually be who I want to be when doing my embroidery. Um, so I don't know how well you'll be able to actually see this. Now, I just want to double check. I'm going to find, okay, this section is really white, unlike down here really white. I just want to see if there is fallout. So I'm focusing down here. Barely. Barely, barely belly. <laughs> barely, barely. So for I am covered in glitter. And that was the love a lot has glitter in it. Yay. <laughs> I don't like glitter. Okay, this is actually getting really cute. I do like this. So I'm gonna go ahead and pause. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna attempt to try to get the other eye to look this amazing. I normally can get one eye done correctly and the other eye is what butchers it and then I end up messing up both eyes. But I will give it a shot. I will bring you back in a little bit. So yeah, wish me luck. Okay. This is actually really freaking cute. Um, and I actually didn't do too bad the first try. Um, I'm just going in with a little bit of the fun shine, which was the lighter of the colors, um, just to kind of give it a little bit on um, um, the inner inner part of the eye. Other than that, I think it actually looks really freaking cute. Um, so yeah, I've finished that part. It's going to drive me nuts. I just, I have to do it. I blow into my makeup all the time because I cannot have extra fallout just sitting in there. Um, I'm just going to go underneath without touching where I've worked. Um, but yeah, I, I can't complain. I actually really like this look, um, which is, it's a total, like, every day, every day I could do this look type thing. And God, it's hot in this car again. Truck, whatever. Um, so yeah, like I've said, I'm from Hills, or from Hillsboro, Oregon, but Oregon, normally, especially, it is March, start of March. Um, it is not normally hot. But y'all, I'm going to start sweating in my truck again. Woo! And I'm, I'm skipping steps because I really want to get out of this truck. Um, but crimp the lashes really quick. No, I don't think it really did anything. My lashes are stubborn. Um, it's been about three weeks since I had them... Um, uh, a lash lift, which is a lash perm done. Um, I just have where my lashes love to go board straight. And I think my next appointment is either at the end of March or, um, right around my birthday, which is start of, well, my birthday's middle of April, but I think I might've selected it for, um, start of April, but I'm already like, yeah, and this is why I don't do mascara at the start. Um, yeah, me and mascara just don't go together. Now I got a black line I got to try to get rid of. And this is exactly why I don't do um, mascara at the end. I'm, I'm terrible at it, but 
So y'all will notice um, what I was talking about with lashes, by the way, is um, eventually my, lash my lashes will become very, very straight, especially this eye. Um, I don't want to say it's a genetic thing, but it kind of is. Um, my mom has the same exact problem. But yeah, so I love it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put the mascara away so I don't end up dropping it. And then I'm going to go in with uh, my setting spray. And I'm going to go ahead and set my, la or my lashes. <laughs> I'm going to set my eyeshadow. Um, so this is the Urban Decay um, D Slick. I don't even have to open my eyes to know. I really truly love the smell of this stuff. Um, smells great. Um, I mean, it, it smells cosmetic, but it's not like a whole that's like um, alcohol smell. Um, smells pretty good. It's uh, decent if I can get everything into this little pouch, um, but it's not too bad. So I'm going to go in with my last step, which is actually putting on the gloss from Jeffree Star. Um, this one is a succulent, um, is this particular, uh, gloss. I actually got this in one of, uh, or was this in my, I don't remember. No, I think I got, I don't know. <laughs> you have to go back and look at my videos. I don't remember. I just, I have one too many of Jeffree Star stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead. I just want this to be a soft look. I didn't want this to be a bright look. Man, that smells candied. Oh, okay. I got this with my alien uh, palette. <laughs> so, because it smells like the uh, fun dip, the candy fun dip sticks. Um, smells delicious, by the way. Wow, that's glittery. I don't remember it being that glittery the first time I wore it. Okay. So, I'm just going to go <laughs> go in with one coat, uh, all I did, as you've seen, I just applied it to my bottom lip and that is all, to kind of uh, spread it between the two because that's pretty, uh, pretty crazy. So, but that is the look. I will post photos at the end of this video so you guys can see. Also, I will have it posted on Instagram as well. And if you do not follow me on Instagram, I will link those down in the description below. But I do go by Dirty Princess Oregon um, for my personal page. And then I go with Dirty dot princess dot makeup for the makeup one uh but feel free you can subscribe on both would love to have the followers and then um like i said comment below if you have any questions or you'd like me to see or like to see me do any palettes feel free to hit me up and i would love to do that for you guys thank you so much for watching and hope to also see you hit that subscribe button thanks everyone have a wonderful day Hey everybody, um, so I wanted to check in with you guys at the end of this or the video from actually yesterday. Um, so this uh, Care Bear palette, I actually like it. Um, so I did the uh, orangish colors on my eyes technically yesterday. Um, I ended up having to work at quite a few shifts where I only got about an hour of sleep. Um, I worked 4 a.m. 4 a to a little bit after 8 a.m. And then um, I had to do about a 30, 40 minute drive to my next job. That started at 10 o'clock, but I did the makeup tutorial in my truck, so um, I gave that time. And then um, I worked my other job 10 to 2 and had some stuff to do um, errand-wise, I should say. And so um, I ended up having a few things to do come home ate dinner I only had about an hour and a half before I had to start my next job at 8 30 technically which was my first job at four o'clock 
I had to do at 8.30 p.m. till um, I clocked off at 12.40 a.m. I think it was this morning. Um, and then lo and behold, I came home, ate a little bit, laid down for about an hour, uh, hour, five minutes type thing. I think that's what my watch had said. Um, and then I actually um, had to be back at work at 4 a.m. in the morning. So lo and behold, it's now 11-ish. I am tired. I haven't had a whole lot of sleep. It's been well over 24 hours. Uh, crackly voice. <laughs> but I wanted to tell you guys, this was awesome. Um, I had I had this on all day. Literally, I just, obviously you can tell, I just got out of the shower. That's when I finally took it off. It hadn't creased, it hadn't done anything. I, um, right before I had actually started shift um, this morning, I wanted to look a little decent because I did sleep for an hour and my makeup kind of went on one side. So I just touched it up a little bit. Uh, same with the eyeliner and I look great. I actually had compliments on it, um, everything. So I have to say, and I, I'm pretty sure the um, eye primer potion uh, by Urban Decay that I use is one of the culprits of keeping it looking good. Um, but I really liked actually how those colors came together and how well it stayed for as long as it did. So just wanted to give my little tidbit on it. Um, you will see more videos with this on here. Um, just kind of giving you guys ideas of different techniques you could use or different um, colors together, which one would look good with what, um, and kind of go from there with it. So hopefully everybody, you're, yeah, hopefully you all uh, like the video. Um, but everybody have a wonderful day. I'm gonna go ahead and go off to bed for a little bit. Um, Thank God it's the weekend now, so no more work for me. So, everybody have a great day, and I'll see you all again. Yeah! <laughs> I'll see you all in another video. I'm going to bed. See ya. <laughs>